welcome class 6 <clears throat> today we will learn to find lcm by using common division method and this method is very important so here we have the example 8 12 and 24 of which we have to find the lcm by using the common division method so the given numbers are taken and then we will do the division method and here 2 will divide all the given numbers so 2 can divide 8 12 and 24 so we have taken 2 and thus we will divide 2 4 times is 8 2 6 times gives 12 and 2 into 12 is equal to 24 now the numbers are 4 6 and 12 in this step we will think of a number that can divide all these three numbers 4 6 and 12 and again the number is 2 so 2 will divide 4 2 times so 2 into 2 is 4 2 into 3 is 6 and 2 into 6 is equal to 12 the next number 2 3 and 6 can be divided further by 2 so here 2 into 1 is equal to 2 3 cannot be divided so when the number cannot be divided then we write down that number as it is so 3 comes down as it is and again 2 can divide 6 3 times so we write 3 now here since 2 of the numbers can be divided by 3 itself so we divide by 3 so 3 cannot divide 1 so 1 comes down as it is and 3 can divide this 3 1 times as well as this one so we get 2 2 2 3 and 1 so the LCM is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 so here 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 which is equal to 24 and the 24 is the required answer similarly if we have to find the LCM by common division method of 20 30 and 36 we will write these numbers and then again we will divide it by the number which can divide all these numbers that is 2 most of the time an even number is divisible by 2 so we take 2 first so 2 can divide 20 can be divided by 2 10 times 2 into 15 gives 30 and 2 into 18 gives 36 so we get 10 15 and 18 again 10 15 and 18 will be further again divided by 2 so 2 will divide 10 5 times 15 cannot be divided so 15 comes down as it is and 18 is divided 9 times here 5 and 15 can be divided by 5 so 5 will divide 5 1 times and 15 is divided 3 times and 9 cannot be divided so 9 comes down as it is now 3 and 9 is divisible by 3 so 3 will divide 3 cannot divide 1 so comes down 1 as it is 3 is divisible by 3 1 times 3 ones are 3 and 3 into 3 is 9 so we get again 3 can divide 1 times each so 1 is not divisible and this one is also not divisible but this 3 is divisible by 3 1 times so we get 2 2 5 3 3 and if we arrange them properly then we'll write it as 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 into 5 and this is equal to 118 so LCM is equal to 180 lastly 16 24 and 36 so again here 16 24 and 36 all the numbers are even numbers so can be divided by 2 so we always choose a prime number over here okay we will not choose the numbers like 4 6 or 10 we will choose the number which can divide okay which which is a prime number so 2 will divide all the given numbers so 2 can divide 16 8 times 24 12 times and 36 again 18 times next again we'll take 2 and divide 2 will divide 8 4 times 12 is divided 6 times and 18 is divided 9 times next again 2 can divide 4 and 6 so 2 into 2 is 4 2 into 3 is 6 
and 9 is not divisible so 9 comes down as it is. Now here 3 and 9 can be divided by 3. So 2 is written as it is since 2 cannot be divided by 3 so 2 comes down as it is and 3 into 1 is 3 and 3 into 3 is 9. So we get 2 and 3 also left out over here. 2 and 3 cannot be divided by any number so we write 2 and 3 as it is out here. That means we have total of 1, 2, 3 and 4, 2 that is 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. So there are 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 there, that means there are 4 2's and 3 into 3. Alright. So when you multiply all these numbers you will get that is equal to 144 which is the required answer.